And when they cut the converter off, they do a lot of damage. Now, to replace this with OEM parts and put it back to the original way it was could be up to $3,000. It's a costly crime that more and more people are falling victim to. Police seeing a spike in catalytic converter thefts, warning car owners to take caution. Casey Cronus is live with the latest. Casey. Corey and Don, the cost of rhodium, according to police, has gone up significantly and it's led to a surge in thefts. Thieves can usually steal the auto part in less than 10 minutes and typically work in teams of two. It's a dreaded sound that usually means just one thing. Someone has stolen your catalytic converter. This evening, police were called to Catalpa and Polina, where we found a partially removed catalytic converter hanging from a vehicle. It has precious metal in it. And right now, the metal in a catalytic converter is worth more than gold. Gary Kinsler, the owner of Auto House on Lincoln Avenue, is seeing the uptick firsthand. On average, he gets about seven cars brought to his shop each week because their converters were sawed off. They'll go here, cut, cut here, cut up here, it's out. One common safety measure used to deter thieves is a cage or lock that makes it harder to steal. But Kinsler says it isn't foolproof. Thieves can just cut more from underneath the car, taking the cage with the converter. And we said, how can we slow this down? He and his mechanics came up with a different technique. They've installed it on more than 50 cars. None of them have been targeted again. This is a 3 8 3 8 cable. It's braided. We'll spot weld it here. We'll spot weld it on the pipe. Then we will spot, leave a little slack in it and spot weld it on the converter. It makes it very hard for them to take it up. He says it's simple, affordable, and can be done at any shop. Just yesterday, a man was shot twice in West Rogers Park after confronting someone trying to steal his catalytic converter. At last check, that man is in fair condition, but police are urging the public not to approach anyone who is suspected of stealing yours. You are encouraged to report it to police and contact your insurance company instead. Live from the 19th, 19th District Chicago Police Department, Casey Cronus, Fox 32, Chicago.